Hi, this is Christine with Search in the City. Search in the City is a small business here in the Triangle and we create scavenger hunts. And we are gonna do a little catch up today um, of what's, going to, what's been going on for the last two weeks since our last Facebook Live. So first of all, first of all, first off, Indie, Indie's week, best of the Triangle came out yesterday, the, the final results for this year. And we did not grab that top spot, but that's okay. Uh, congrats to Something Fabulous who did get the top event planning spot, so congrats to you. Uh, we did make one of the top five finalists though, so we are super excited about that. And we're gonna pick up one of the newspapers today, and I believe in the newspapers it will have us listed as one of the finalists, so that's terrific. Uh, publicity for us so we're really excited about it and you know we just we have a, a goal to set for next year to try to try to get that top spot and we we have some hard work to do but uh, we are ready to do it and we're really excited about the future of search in the city and oh and thank you for your votes we couldn't have done it without you thank you thank you thank you so much for voting for search in the city uh, so we also want to talk about Sardines, our newest photo and go scavenger hunt that is going to launch. We did set an opening night date, and that's going to be August 6th, which is a Friday. It's actually going to learn, uh, fall on first Friday, which will be pretty convenient since that's a big thing that happens in downtown Raleigh. This hunt does happen in downtown Raleigh in the warehouse district. It's a 90 minute competitive hunt. It's gonna go from 7 to 8.30 p.m. on select Fridays. So if you can't make it to August 6th opening night, there are gonna be other Fridays throughout the year that you can go ahead and book it. And you can book these already. They are live on our website to book. So you can grab your tickets there and get your team ready and uh, try to find that sardine. So like I was saying, it is a 90 minute hunt and it's throughout the warehouse district. It is $20 per person plus tax. And as of right now, we are only asking people who are 21 and up to buy tickets. The reason for that is we're not sure where the starting location is gonna be and or the, lo the ending location. Uh, we're working that out right now and it could end up being a brewery or a bar. So we wanna make sure we're not selling tickets to underage people if that's how it ends up being. Now, if it doesn't end up being like that, then we'll drop the age and then you can buy tickets for your children or, um, or younger people in your lives. Um, so that may happen, but right now it's 21 and up. Now, if you are interested in a photo go hunt that is kid friendly, don't worry. We have some that are coming down the pipeline that will be kid friendly and will be during more of like a daytime hours so that, uh, so that your kids can enjoy as well. Uh, so look out for sardines. It's kind of getting a lot of buzz right now. I know that Raleigh Over Easy mentioned it in their newsletter. So did Midtown Magazine. And we've gotten some mentions on different people's websites like Raleigh Magazine and Triangle Downtowner. And we're on the Triangle on the Cheap's community Facebook page. So look out for that. That's us. That's the Sardine Scavenger Hunt. That again is opening on August 6th is opening night. So that's all we came here to say today. Our next Facebook Live will be on Thursday, July 29th. So very soon before our opening night. And thanks for tuning in and cheers.